Welcome back to Kids Fun Science. My name's Ken. Today's experiment is making a string form a perfect circle. As always, adult supervision is required. What you need for this experiment is four bendy straws, a pencil, some string, a bowl, and dish soap, uh, which I'll explain in the description where I get it, and scissors. So putting it uh, together is you're basically going to take the straws, uh, bendy straws, you're going to cut each end of the bendy straw, and then you're going to squeeze it together and then slide the bigger end of the straw, forming a square um, of any, any size. You could cut the, sh the straw down a little bit smaller, but just remember the size of your circle is going to determine on how big you can. So at the end result, you put them all together and you have a bubble frame. So some helpful tips here. Cut the string six to eight inches long. Tie the string to make a circle, but make sure that circle can fit inside the straw square you just made. Then cut off the extra string where you tied the knot and then dip the string into the bubble solution, therefore making it um, more easier to drop on top of the bubble. So you take your bubble frame and you dip it into the solution and pull it up so until the bubble is completely there. Then you take your string that you've already dipped into the solution and you lay it lightly on top. If you drop it, it'll go all the way through. And then you're going to take your pencil and you're going to poke it into one of the holes of the string. And ta-da! There it is. That is making your string into a perfect circle. And you can take your hand and put it all the way through because the, even though the bubble is on the outside of the frame, there is no bubble on the inside, which is pretty cool. As you can see, Grace putting her hand all the way through, um, and you can see the bubble there, That's which is pretty amazing. So now the science behind this. So the science behind this is the surface tension pulls in a way that minimizes the area with the soap membrane. This means it maximizes the area inside the string without the membrane. The biggest area per given circumference, the string, results in the perfect circle. The soap water on the outside of the string pulls towards the frame and opens up the string loop. This is because the soap pulls in the same strength everywhere and it forms a perfect circle. So we tried a couple different times to get more than two strings. We weren't able to. We were able to get two, which is pretty cool. So there's one, um, and we popped the circle there. That one kind of just formed right off the bat. Um, you kind of don't want to throw it. You want to gently put that down. And then make your second string a little bit smaller because you only have so much frame in there to put it. And pop that, and there you go. We got two. You could actually pull it around like uh, Grace is doing there. It tends to always want to go to the outside, and you can still do your hand through. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, if you did, please click thumbs up and share. And thanks for watching. Hello? Oh, yeah, okay. Um, you're asking about Kids Fun Tech? Yeah, we have videos right there and right there and right there and right there. And I'm pointing at the videos. Ugh. Well, we have like those videos over here and those videos over here. Okay, fine, hang up.